Oh, yeah, it's boy Ella Shepard have two five four. As you can see, current temperature is a high of a 64, low of a 30. Check my handy dandy telephone, and it tells me that the temperature is. Currently 49 degrees. So, let me show you what we got going on. As you can see here, we removed the throttle body. We got the auto air control valve off. Um, I'm gonna go to the junkyard, get another one, slap it on there, and see if that does the job. I am kind of curious, dude. I know that it's kind of specific to the models and shit, but it's very, very, very familiar. It's familiar to the same out of control valve for uh, the Caprice for the LS motors and shit. So I looked it up. It's not interchangeable, but you know I was gonna try to try to do it anyway. So I'm gonna run to the junkyard, get a replacement, and uh, we'll be back. The regular one, it's just like sixty dollars in the store. So I'm going to the fucking junkyard. Fuck that. I can go get two for like three ninety nine. So you know we're back out here. Oh shit, son. It's chilly than a motherfucker. About fifty degrees. I just came for one or two things and we can beat the fuck out. I wonder. Is that the one for my car? Because if the wheel bearing is any good, I could put that shit on the, I could put that shit on the fucking, hmm. Yeah, I could use the wheel bearing off of that bitch. Cause I'm pretty sure mine is identical to this shit here. This throttle body is so I don't I don't know that this this one would be the same. Uh, fuck it as well we'll try right. We gotta do just stick a little handy dandy screwdriver in there. Oh yeah, this came out way easier than mine. <laughs> My shit came off like man, it was terrible. Alright, so as you can see, the fan, aka the Toronado. You know we got the throttle body popped up just like we did over there. So we're gonna get this off. Get on back to the crib, crib naive, the crib naive. Yeah, it's that scrappy talk. The crib naive. All right, so I just pee this shit and I walk around this little car, man. I'm like, shit, shit like some last of the Mohicans type shit. Anyway. Yeah, we could probably use that for the antenna, that antenna joint. You know what I'm saying? For the Rivy. Get our up and down antenna game going. This this be next time. I ain't getting that shit today. It's cold. Of course the interior is fucked off. We know that from last time though. The 1991 tornado. 
everything under the hood is pretty much the same. So it got me thinking like, what could I grab off this bitch? I really don't know. Being it, <clears throat> being it is kind of like hard to, well, I won't say hard to come by, but you know, rare, <laughs> more extinct than shit. I was thinking eventually I'll just come take out this shit. And I got the same setup. I'm, saying, I'm pretty sure for the for the shock assembly as well as I'm saying the rotors and shit. Wheel bearings. I'm gonna put new shit. I'm not gonna put no busted ass shit on. Hey, right, so uh, I spared y'all the the madness of you know taking my throttle body off and shit. Uh, <clears throat> I'll go ahead and explain it for y'all. Uh, what well, it's three screws that hold the throttle body on the three bolts uh, One up under there one down there one On the back side This here comes off uh, Disconnect the throttle body linkage and all that shit Three bolts boom that pops off you definitely want to change You definitely want to take this off when you do it because I think that I fucking cross started that shit. And then I just had to fucking drive it home because home run bitches. <laughs> so um see cause it, it feels like it's a little it's a little loose. Like I don't think it's like break the bank loose, but yeah, I mean worst case scenario I go to the junkyard I take the fucking throttle body from there. I think I'm gonna just go grab that shit off of GP. Uh, so yeah. We uh, got it all hooked up together. I cranked it already, I ain't gonna lie to you. It's already working. But I wanted to crank it again to make sure it was still crank for the camera. You know, a car like to embarrass me and shit. <laughs> car like, oh, we recording? <laughs> Fuck that. You know what I'm saying? So, it'd be like to show out and break down for, for the camera. So. See we up the temperature. Hopefully that was it. Uh, the part is originally like a, the part is like a sixty dollar part from your local parts store. Uh, just in case this shit don't fix it, I went ahead and ordered uh, <laughs> a new one from Rock Auto for eight bucks, eight eight eighty eight dollars and eight eighty something cents something. So just in case this shit don't work, the other throttle, I'll go get that other throttle body, throw that sensor on there. Um, shit, I might just buy another throttle position sensor, a new throttle position sensor, a new fucking idle air control, a new mass airflow. All of those three are on the throttle body. There's the idle air, there's the throttle position, and there's the mass air. I might just buy all new three of them sits and then just fucking <coughs> put them shits on there with the throttle body because, yeah, the car is being dumb. So, I mean, we should be, we should be good to go. I mean, like, look up under the hood, make sure we ain't put out nothing. Crank it one more time just to make sure. I also was checking on some other stuff to see if it was gonna work, but who knows? Okay. So the review rise again. 
this time it wasn't down that long, just a couple two hours. Really. Um after learning everything that we learned about you know the car and all the different sensors that are on it and you know knowing what we've replaced already and shit like that makes it that much easier to be like okay well we've replaced this this and this we haven't replaced this this and this so these are the possible things that could be wrong so like I say idle air control along the way along with a new filter both for like 17 bucks um i didn't order that i didn't order that wheel bearing yet um i guess i should go ahead and order that i should have ordered it when i ordered the other shit um yeah Anyway, this is your boy, Shadow Ride254. Remember, identify your weaknesses, make it your strengths, gone.